What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's Hey, what's poppin'? What's poppin'? What's? Hey, what up, Tiger Little Squad Gang Gang? How you living? How you breathing? How you feeling? Where y'all been? Like, where y'all been? Where y'all been? Without further ado, don't forget to like, a comment, and subscribe. Turn on all your post notification bells. That's that little bell that they put here or there or everywhere, wherever it is. Turn it on so you never miss a beat from your girl Essence of Shade. Let's get right into the video. Hi, Tiger Lily Squad. How y'all doing? I haven't spoken to you guys. Because y'all just disown me. Y'all went about your business. Y'all going on other people's pages. Y'all subscribing to everybody else. Y'all ain't worried about your sis no more. I get it. I really don't. But you know it is what it is. <laughs> But yeah, so I wanted to come with an update on my hair and how my hair has been doing. And right now, we have not retwisted our hair in about two weeks. Um, I just washed it the other day and I won't retwist it um, for another, I want to say two weeks um, or a week. I've cut a significant amount of my hair, meaning like I the thin parts, um, I don't think I could find any right now because I legit trimmed it all off. Whatever was thinning like in between the lock is cut. That's why some of these are super short. Whatever was uh, thinning in between the lock, like that completely came off. Like I like just like trimmed it. For the most part, that was like in the back of my hair. So the back of my hair is really short. I'm going to show you guys a clip of that. Um, but I have been taking my hair vitamins regularly. I've been drinking water. Not as much as I used. Sorry, I don't know where I was. My old boss called me because, you know, we've been, we've been closed this entire time. Uh, so I haven't really been working like i've been working for me but not like a clock in job so he just called me so i don't remember where i was but i do uh want to say that this journey has been uh difficult not difficult been easy because um i've had my locks for about 18 years so I kind of already know what to do. I know the do's and don'ts. I know what worked for me, what didn't work for me. Um, I did color my hair again. Um, can't really see it now, but you can see, if you go on my Instagram, follow me on there at Essence of Shea. Um, I showed you my color, um, but I, I was running away from the color because of the damage it did for my hair, my my locks. Um, and made my locks super thin. And that was mainly because I didn't wash it out completely. I was lazy. Also, um, I didn't moisturize it double the amount that I would usually do. Because um, when you color your hair, you change uh, the porosity and all of that stuff in your hair. So, um, yeah, so I just been taking my multivitamins. I've been drinking water. I've been moisturizing my hair literally every day with either my lavender hair spritz or just regular distilled water in a bottle. Um but for the most part it would it, it is my lavender hair spritz which is this um a lot of you guys already know about my lavender hair spritz. That this is it emptied. Uh, inside is lavender, dry lavender and rose petals. Um, but a lot of people have been saying how that has helped 
like bring their moisture back into their hair and they love the smell of it and all that stuff and i die by that stuff so um i've been using that uh i've been washing my hair regularly um i've been trying to keep up with my retwist i try not to go over four weeks uh without retwisting my hair because my i noticed with my hair in particular not everybody's like this but mine's in particular um the the what you want to call it it's not the my hair texture cannot go too long without a retwist like that's how i damaged my hair before i would take too long to retwist my hair and um it would separate from the actual lock which would call which would cause thinning um i would try to semi free form but my hair texture just doesn't really and i feel like i had this conversation with y'all before but that my hair texture doesn't really rock with semi free forming so um i mean which is fine i guess it can if I don't know i gotta do more research on it but for the most part it just doesn't i also realized that because i've been working out regularly um for the past three months um i will need to interlock my my roots uh i still haven't found a place where i wanna or i feel comfortable enough to get it done but as soon as i find it you guys will be there along the journey because i remember saying before like i don't know if i ever would do interlocking i've heard bad stuff about it i heard if a person ain't do it right it cause a hole a big hole in your lock and separation all that stuff but i sweat a lot especially on my scalp because of working out and that's why my retwists don't last that long um no matter who does it professional or me it just doesn't last long no matter what they use gel foam it just doesn't last more than a week a week and a half and it's mainly because i work out and either i stop working out and i keep my retwist in <laughs> but it just uh, i just i just i need to work out i just this is just my lifestyle now um so i'm gonna have to get my locks uh interlocked and see how that goes i'm still doing research so if you guys know anybody in the dallas area um leave a comment box or send me a dm on instagram at essence of shea if i happen to be in another state like maryland or something like that i know my girl curly new growth but i would ha i know for sure i would have to like schedule an appointment with her because she's booked and busy sis um but yeah other than that i feel like my hair is not where it used to be I want to talk about that real quick so my hair is not where it used to be meaning that it's not very thick like it used to be um and that it's getting back to its healthiness but it's not as thick as it used to be and when i started this that was my thing like oh yo i'm gonna get my hair back to its thickness i've come to realize that that's not gonna happen the only way that I can get it to come back to how it used to be is probably starting a new set of locks. Um, the damage was already done, unfortunately, with locks. It's not like loose natural hair. Like if you damage it, you could cut a few things and it'll grow back to what it's supposed to do. Unfortunately for me, um, I have locks. So when you damage it, you can repair it essentially but the thickness i don't know if i'm gonna get that back unless i like cut it off completely and start over or i can trim it like really short to the point where like um 
I have like a bob so anything that grows would just be completely new growth so in that case I probably could get back my thickness um but I was looking at old photos of me like where, where my bun used to just be like huge and like uh, I would take out a twist out and it'd just be like so big and fluffy and and it made me a little sad but it's all good um it took me a while to like be okay with it because my hair is a big part of me and um like i said in videos before i kind of disappointed myself um with how i was taking care of it and just not being responsible and neglecting my hair so if you learn anything from my channel is take care of your hair like you take care of your shoes like you take care of your kids like you take care of everything else because um it's important um it's important but i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys enjoyed this update um i'm sorry that i've been gone i've been pretty active on instagram so go over there you'll see some videos and some things go over there sis go over there <laughs> Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, and I love you guys so much for watching. See you later till I get lilies. Cheers. Uh, crash course. Let me hide the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche? Goofy with